Welcome to another One Love Review. And in this review, we're doing Mueller? Mueller? Mueller. You, you what the, does the two dots yeah, mean? The two. You the educated one. <laughs> I, ain't like I would think it means Mueller, but I could be wrong. Mueller, Mueller, potato, potato. You see it. Mm-hmm. You read it. And then, I guess, try to find a way to leave a voice message and tell us what it is. <laughs> anyway, we are doing the Pro Series Multi Chopper Slicer. Because the wife be doing a lot of cooking. I do. And she does a lot of chopping. Yes, I do. Slicing. Mm-hmm. Dicing. I do. And I want to make it easy on her, so. Thank you, babe. I get her this thing. Thank you. I'm uh, excited about it. Yeah. And I cook with a lot of onions. He loves onions. So I yeah, put I onions in a lot of things. I cook a lot of green peppers, yellow peppers, red peppers. You know, we love uh, squash, zucchini. You know, we love all that stuff. So all that. I'm really excited about this thing. Yeah. So it grates. It fine. What? Julian. I don't even know what that means. Julian, fine Julian. It's kind of like... Um, Jelini, uh, Jelini, J- I don't even know how to pronounce that. Like uh, how you shred cat. It's like shred. That's exactly what shred. it is. It's like shredding. Then you got the fine slicer, the slicer, your large dicer, small dicer, and your garnish slicer. Okay. I'm excited. Slicing them. Let's open this bad yeah, boy well, up. Yeah, we ain't gonna hold you. We ain't gonna hold you. Hold them. Grab it and hold them. That's Tony Baker. Grab them and hold them. Uh oh, okay, so this is gonna have some pieces. What these pieces do? I don't know. But we'll figure it out. We got this thing. That's the trap. Mm, excuse me. <coughs> excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> John Coffee. Oh my god. You sounded like Nutty prof- <laughs> Professor. <laughs> That's the top part. I know that part. That's the part that goes like this. Mm-hmm. Oh, there you go, your book. Knock yourself out, babe. Something's free. Something's free. <laughs> free. Free product giveaway. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. To celebrate and thank our supporters, we are giving away a free Juliner peeler. That's the bottom. That's good. So there should be a peeler in there. Oh, oh, I think I figured it already. I'm I'm on top of this game, baby, baby. I don't know. That's clean. Is that the peeler? I don't know what that is. Mm -mm, It's not a peeler. It's not a peeling. I know that. Oh, look at this. This is like putting together like a Lego set. Pretty sure that goes in there like that somewhere. I'm just trying to get everything open. Oh, here's this. Oh, so it comes with a little tray with all your different. These are the different dices right here. That's the dices. I love this. I love this. It says congratulations, right? It says better world and it has different things. And the one thing that I absolutely love, um, it helps our youth. And I'm I'm definitely an advocate for that, losing my my son to suicide. It says Youth Opportunity Center. The Youth Opportunity Center receives donations from Mueller to pro- provide a safe place for thousands of troubled youth and families right here in the U.S. Hmm. That's really cool. Wow. So this is a company we can actually really get behind and yeah. support. Yeah. And if they make a good product, we'll check out more of their products based on that. The blades are really sharp. Keep away from children. Wow. <laughs> So it comes in a little tray. You have your different blades here. You got your shredders, your, your cheddars, your shredders. Okay. Your, well, you show them that I'm going to just rinse this off because your, I really your cheddar to... bobs and your <laughs> shredder. Turn you to a shredder. Cheese. Can't nobody mess with me. Oh, Lord. Well, that's eight miles. And then, of course, your dice is a big one that I showed you earlier. So that's, that's what it comes with. And then this thing, I think this is a a groomer. 
Hey, this is a small box, so I don't need to toss it like I do the others. And we'll actually keep this box and put, put it back in. Let me look at this while she's clean. Let me look at the book. Let me look at the book. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Oh. I see what they're doing. Oh, now I know what this is here. Okay. The book is very specific. I like it. Mm, it has pictures. It's really good. Oh, yeah. A child could use this. Well, right. A child shouldn't be using this. Right. <laughs> but these pictures are very accurate. Okay, how did you have this? I guess this was over here, right? See, she, she don't know how to do it. She ain't look at the pictures. I didn't look at the pictures. It was very wet, babe. So, it's okay. So we're doing it's exactly how I had it though, because I didn't yeah, know. no, I'll just. So this one is a separate one. This one is when you want to use the pull down function to press through, so you don't have to use it in tandem with chopping cover slicing. So this is the chopping cover. Okay. Then you have your slicing and grating insert. So you put this insert in to put in your little blades to use. And you run it over. And like I'm going to need both. I made a potato salad. And um, I don't know what you guys put in your potato salad. But I put green peppers and onions in my potato salad. Um, amongst other things. So I'm going to chop up. I want to chop first. I want to chop this onion. So can you help me do that? Oh, okay. it's, a, it's a safety holder. I don't know what that means so yet. So easily distracted. No, I'm just saying, cause I saw the, the nails on it and uh -huh. I was like, man, that could be like medieval right there. Get medieval on them, but. Okay, so you want to. I want to chop. You want to chop, chop. Let's see, slicing and grating, chopping and dicing. Okay, so for chopping, mm -hmm. There's the little lip on the back of that, if you can see it at the top up here. Yeah, it's dripping because you got water all over it. But it's all good. And there's a little slit back here. So I'm gonna just place that in and push it forward. And there you go. Next, this is already in there, but this can be removed. We wanna have that. So next, you wanna chop it. Mm -hmm. So, we have the slicer here for chopping. We'll take that and lay it inside. Okay. So now it's on the inside. So now she'll put her onion here. Okay. And presto rearrange oh, maybe something will happen. I don't know. We getting ready to find out. Let me move all this out the way so people can see what's really going on. I down. wanna, I feel like, I'm sorry I'm moving, but I feel like I wanna, um, Cut the fat piece of the onion that's all like this little chunk piece that I don't want. Okay. She cheated. No, I don't. Nobody wants that part. It's, oh. it's like uh, yeah, this. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Okay. So uh, just go down? Uh, it like it's so big. Yeah. Um, Does we have to cut it? Let me see here. Should I cut it in half? Maybe you should cut it in half. I would just think. Place food in a blade and firmly prop down. I would think it'd be easier if I cut it in half. Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't say if you should cut but it in I, half. I'm scared like I'm gonna, gonna break, break this. it. I hear it. Oh, it takes a lot of force though. Let me. Okay, I wouldn't be able to do this by myself. Let me. Let me see. Yeah, it does feel like you can break it. But it did it. I think that's just the peel. Yeah, that's the peel. Huh. And then, oh, once the peel was moved, it just went right down. Yeah. It definitely did what it was supposed to. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's uh, try, try to. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cut it in pieces because it, it beats cutting the whole thing. That seemed like a lot easier. That was a lot easier going now, down. Uh, oh, yeah. Still a little like 
Maybe it takes it takes some force to get it down for yeah. sure. She's cutting onions. It's better than cutting onions the other way where you're oh, yeah. I'm always crying over here. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's Yeah. It's a lot faster. Oh, because it goes right back up. Yeah. Okay, so now my thing is What's your, what's your thing? What you got? I is there And now here's a thing to clean it when you um whenever you finish chopping, you just erase all your excess out. Mm-hmm. That's what that's for. But just so y'all can see. Hold on, baby. Let me uh so it cut it. Yeah. Just takes a little bit of a little bit of strength and you don't wanna I wouldn't pull it on the end here. I would press it in the middle. Yeah. Where the green part is. That way you don't snap it. But I would I should have used this one. This dices the dice is my onions instead of uh slice or uh, slicing them. Yeah. I, I thought it was gonna like chop mint dicing, but because you chop it up. Yeah. This is like slices. You should have did one and then did another one on that yeah. one. Yeah. And then you can even do them even smaller. Yeah. So but because wanna... it was big, yeah. I mean. So they okay. have the different sizes. So now we know. And that's why we're reviewing. So well, we know. Well, I, I still have a, a green onion I, I want to do as well. So mm -hmm. why don't you switch that out for me? And then we're going to try to. Um... So all you do. And I already, I already washed my vegetables and pull it up. And then you can use your little raker rake, your raker lake. I want to see if it's going to dice it. For all me. right. So you're gonna wash this one, right? Yes. So I just stick it over here in this here sink for the wash wash. All right. So they actually have like a thing to pull that out with. I'll use my hand, but okay, so you want to use the big dicer? Uh can we use a small one and see what happens? And then if it doesn't, nothing happens. Using we'll... the small dicer. And I can leave the onions in there because actually I'm, I'm putting the onions and the green peppers all in. To the same yeah. game. They all in the same game. Mm. Oh, turn it on the other side. Oh, 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 it's oh, stuck oh. in the blade. <laughs> that was a lot easier when you flipped it over. Well, because it already... Uh -huh. But that is... Oh, yeah. It cut exactly how I wanted it to cut. Yeah, so it... It, it definitely... Ooh, it definitely diced them up. Yeah, it diced them up. Instead of slicing them up. So yeah. That's good. You turn do it, feel it like... Um, you're you break it. have the skins facing up if you have something with skin. It doesn't matter. Oh, it doesn't matter. Because still. what I do, what I suggest is doing it halfway and then see if you can flip it. Because then it's already cut. Okay. Ah. So it sort of gives it a start. Yeah. It's hard though. This is. I don't think I'm gonna be using this. Yeah. It's not as. It's not as easy as it. I wish it would. Yeah, that's not. That gets too hard. And don't want to. I'm, I'm, I'm such a fast cook. I already have those things diced yeah. up and. Yep. Yep. This might not be the ticket. I mean, I like what you know they stand for and stuff, but maybe just leave that there, baby. We could just try to go down yeah, on go that ahead. part. Yeah. Just, just go down. <laughs> ah, there it goes. Yeah. It's Maybe not I'm, so easy though. No. And and I broke them into pieces. So if I'm already gonna do that, it takes no time, ladies. Yeah, if you're a cook, it takes no time to. By the time I do this, I have to clean another thing. Yes. So, for me, I appreciate Babe's effort because hey, he knows that I'm always here cooking. It's worth a try. But and there might be something softer that she could use it for, but. I have arthritic these, fingers. These gr uh, these green. Green, uh, what's we call it? But even Pepper, the green onions peppers. and it's just it's 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 hard. I am gonna finish doing it though. You put a small one. In and... Yeah, I feel like uh, if you cut it into smaller pieces, but by, again, but again, by if that you're time, if you cut it that small, you must. If I'm gonna cut it this time, I, I'm already done. So it's a lot more effective cutting small pieces. Don't yeah. put a big piece on yeah. it. Yeah. Oh yeah. See. 
Now it looks like, it, yeah, that's it's worth it now. But for me, I, you have to cut them up in so much, so such small pieces that. I don't think you need to cut it that way. Well, because it's had that thing, I have to cut it. Oh, out. okay. So if it's smaller pieces, it works great. Yeah. Now we have not tried the grating part of it, which is where you're just going to go over it with something, and I think that might be pretty pretty easy because that's not something you have to press. Right. It's um pull out two of them. So with the grater, you're just gonna slide it over it. So that would be worth it. Yeah. I mean it could if it's something if it's, it's something, something simple. small and simple because yeah. I have a bigger grater. You know that yeah. if I'm gonna grade something a I have wider a wider one. Right. I yeah. have a big wide one. So yeah short I mean so this, I can see how this part would be a lot better because you're not pressing. But of course, if you have a bigger one. But again, I mean, the great. cubes are really diced up really mm -hmm. nice. I mean, the green uh, green peppers, they're diced up in like little cubes, perfectly sized. Everything is even. Again, it, it's, it's a, I don't know if I'm going to take it out just to do that. Because once I start, I'm just going to keep going. Yeah. But you I never know. There it. might be a day where she's like, let me just try it. Yeah. Or I have somebody in the kitchen helping me oh, yeah. that is not as fast as I am. Mm -hmm. And it'd be easier for them to just do that. And it's easier for them to just, just do yeah. that. Yeah. Agreed. I agree with that. Yeah. So, I mean, I probably will still use it every now and then. Um, I mean, I pretty, mean, you could cut cheese. Yeah. Like, you know, put, that probably should be much simpler. Okay. So, this thing here. Is actually for when you're grating. You put this over the top and go back and forth with the grater so you're not using Oh, your that is so much. Because even our big one, you know, if you get too close, you're going to get your yeah, hands. Yeah, this will protect your hands from the grater. Yeah. So I was wondering what that was for. So it's like a little slicer, you know, when you go to mm -hmm. the deli. And uh, so this is to protect your fingers. Yeah. I actually like that. I like that. I'm going to try it. I'm going to, I'm, you know, I'm not going to knock it. I'm going to try other aspects of it. And you never know. Maybe uh, after she uses some more, maybe we'll do a follow-up if things yeah. look good. Yeah, yeah. Or don't look good. Yeah. We'll just do a follow-up. I will do a follow-up regardless, if I, especially if I find things that are easier to use this with and more efficient in the kitchen. Yeah! But thank you. Thank you. See? <laughs> Hello. Hi. Who knows that? If you know that song, put a comment in the in the, the comment section. Oh Lord. Hey, that's that's old school right there. That's old school. So um, she's gonna put this in the potato salad. Yeah. You want you want to put that in the potato salad now? Well, I have to um, uh, I have to cut up the onions. I can't put whole onions in there like that. Why not? No. Mm -mm. I would eat it like that. Put that potato salad over here, babe, so people can see it. Say salad. Let me see Oh, well, daddy. I was doing a daddy. lot of things today, so my potatoes got a little bit overcooked, but the flavor, babe, get a spoon. The flavor, I guarantee you, is a banging. A spoon? Yeah, so you can... Uh, a spoon? A spoon? Um, I put um, Hellman's mayonnaise, and then we have this mayonnaise that has a little bit of lime in it. I know you're like, oh, you guys put lime in everything. It actually, it's really good. Um, so I put uh, mayonnaise and black pepper and sea salt and paprika and, and mustard. I also put mustard yeah, in have it. Have a bite. Have a bite. And I put sweet relish. Mm. And I tasted it, right? The taste is banging. Mm hmm So it's really good. So even though my potatoes are a little bit overcooked. The only thing missing? Some onions. And I'm going to... Chop she's gonna chop those up and put them in there now. Because mm -hmm. if I use the mm -hmm. dicer instead of the slicer, it would have been done. But oh well. It slices, it dices. And this potato salad is just for him and I, so. Yeah, it's just for us. Y'all can't have none. Okay, I think you can. Yeah, I think it'll be all right now. I think that'll be all right. <laughs> Yeah, go ahead and put, go ahead and put that inside the thing and yeah, it's going to be marinated. Yeah, I'm real good. 
It look real lovely. That look real lovely. <laughs> Whoa! Scooby Rabbit! Whoa! 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 Oh, yeah. See, that's a chop, chop, chop it. A chop, chop, chop. So I see how she, you know she does the thing with that. Me, that's just me though. Hmm? But hopefully I'll never have to. Can you move that out my way? My elbow hits it. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> She's chop chop chopping it. Chop chop chopping. It. All right, so that looks pretty chop big. Yeah, I mean, it is a small chopper, so it's kind of hard, but um, the board. Small cutting board. Cutting board. <laughs> chopper. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> My brain's not working well right now. Okay. All right. So she'll mix that all in. And um, yeah, so Mueller. We're going to give it one more shot. It seems like it'll be good for some things. A little iffy on the other. But yeah. also, it depends on how the size you cut it. But most people don't want to have to cut it down to use it. Right, so, and I'm going to cut it all the way to the smallest size. And guess what? I'm just going to finish cutting it. Yeah. Um, we didn't use the grater, but maybe when we do the fault review, we'll do the grater. I think it might work a lot better because you're not having to pull that handle down. I think just for the dicer, that's what the issue comes in. But we'll use it some more and do a follow-up review and let y'all know. But as of right now, it's on the we're on the fence. We're on the fence. Yeah, I'm on the fence. So let us know if this is something you was thinking about putting in your kitchen. And let us know if this review might have you waiting a little bit for a follow-up so you can see if it's really right for you and stay tuned make sure you like you subscribe we're 15 subscribers away from giving away an air fryer oh that's so, nice yeah so 15 people if you're watching subscribe so we can go ahead and give somebody an air fryer then of course our next goal is give away two kasori air fryers so be sure that you're subscribed, you have the notification bell on, and you're liking the videos, and you're watching, and giving us some comments, some feedback. Let us know if there's anything out there you want us to try, or if there's anything out there you want to see us eat, review. And we'll have Quincy and Derek on here some more, we'll trying to get their schedules lined up so we can uh, do some more reviews with them, because they are off the chain. But till then, she's mixing in some potato salad, Live, love, laugh, and juice it. Taste that. Right, give me a Taste minute that. to get it all pretty, and then you can. She gonna get it all pretty. But we out. Right. Wait, let me get a picture so you can get a picture of it.